All these places that the CM stone base. Past 20 CM grade 14 concrete. that we should sell our conscience and say the country for nothing. For nothing. We paid 33 billion on this job since September. Nothing reasonable has been done on the job. And then we are here under our nose, this thing. I was here two weeks and I did the same thing and they continue to feed this thing with, you know, useless rat right. If it's even rat right, it's a different ball game. But this is clear. And by right, it's not supposed to be on the job. Only current registered engineers are allowed to be on our project site. Look at what you people are here. Look at what is happening. All these engineers of the ministry should report to Abuja, you know, immediately, first thing on Monday, including you, and then write to RCC management to proceed to see us. It's a shame. Minister, not only you. I have a, a sent him out of sight. Sent him out of sight. Where is the other woman? You are the acting controller from now. I've indicted you more than five different times. Each time I come, you don't seem to know what you are doing. Okay? You don't seem to know what you are doing. I suspended you before. Record you. Look at what you are doing to ourselves. Look at what we are doing to ourselves. At the end of the day, they will call the president, they will call the minister. But look at what you people are doing to, to, the, to the nation. I was here and they did exactly the same thing. And there was nothing in it. And we are paying for sharp sand. And we are paying very high for sharp sand. From today, you are out of the site, including you, two of you. You are not qualified to be on the site. And the job should stop. Uh, RCC management should see me in Abuja on Monday. For us to respect us. We are not stupid. We are not stupid people. Yeah. Pour water on it for him. Be pressing it. Press it. Finished. What the water? So this is the sand. From the volume of what you take, this is what you have. Is that correct? I'm asking you a question. From the volume of what you've taken, this is the, the this is the sand. The Federal Executive Council directed that we must have a Korean registered engineer in all our projects. And then we have communicated that. Who is the Korean registered engineer? Huh? Are you a Korean engineer? It's current register. Current, I have one. It's current. Mining engineer. Huh? Mining engineer. Mining. And surveyor. You have come under my listing more than five different times. You can you are not fit to survive this project. You are not fit. We have uh, a section of Enugu Port Harcourt Road. Uh, the entire sections are being handled by four different contractors. Starting from Enugu, we have CGC. And then you come over to Setraco, you come over to Arab Contractor, and then this section from Aba, you know, um, down to uh, LMA Junction is being handled by CCCC. 
funding has been a very huge problem of uh, this job. But uh, Mr. President has directed that uh, everything should be done to complete some of the critical uh, routes in all the regions of uh, Nigeria. And that's why I'm going around to inspect some of the critical routes. Uh, you know, I was in uh, Makodi, uh, Abuja, uh, that's Maraba sections to Kefi, Kefi to Makodi, Makodi to Otukbo, Otukbo to Otukba, and then to Ninth Mile. And that was on a Thursday and part of Friday. And so uh, today, uh, that's very critical. And then today we are on these uh, sections of, uh, you know, the four sections. And uh, the contractor is back to site, I appeal to them. They have been owed, uh, they have not been paid. But we're looking uh, critically at the directive of Mr. President, who is doing everything possible to source for funds to uh, complete a number of critical projects, you know, scattered, you know, all over the, the regions of Nigeria. And so today, we have agreed with the contractor on how to redesign this route for effectiveness and for both in court and stability. And what we've directed is that don't destroy the existing asphalt. They are fairly stable with felt, you know, pavement. And so we've directed that they should mill it, uh, the 40 and the 60, and then keep it on site, and then pulverize it, uh, pulverize it, and then put 10 cm of uh, stone base and expose it to traffic with a water tanker and then after that fairly about two months then they should be able to come back and then put uh, another 10 cm of stone base with five percent cement and that will be the base cost and then they will begin to lay the asphalt uh, 60 binder and the 40 wearing however in all our bids now and review we are going to bring in a clause and that is every contractor on our projects we also put an alternative to uh, bitumen alternative to asphalt work and that's by directing them to put rate only uh, for concrete put on a reinforced concrete for the uh, pavement and then for the shoulder using BRC. so before I, I tell you that let me also say that we are committed to you know the carriage of 7.3 with for you know con um, asphalt and then the shoulders is 2.75 uh, 2.75 and that's about 5. Point, uh, five again which is over 70 percent of the carriage one we are doing that in concrete you know so that is the, so um we uh know that asphalt is on increase on weekly basis so i believe strongly that in the next one month everybody will have an alternative of concrete because we can't continue to increase the prices of our root jobs and the money is not there to pay so we have to devise thinking outside the box the directive of Mr. President on how we can forge ahead on even a better rigid pavement, you know, which will last 50 years. Okay, lastly, uh, you mentioned some of the things set on this group. Yeah, your... yeah, directive is uh, to go and the first thing to do is to isolate all the first sections, both carriageways, and then dig it to one meter, then fill back with lumps, fill with sharp sand, lumps 50 cm, uh, sharp sand 40 cm, and then also fill with stone base 20 cm. Uh, when you do this, it will be 10 cm above the existing level. And so when you put water and then expose it to traffic, it will come back to the existing level. And so the treatment for carriageway will now continue. So if we do what we have directed them to do, and my director and supervisors and controllers are committed to it, we have a very good road in a short period because our problem is just these fell sections. If we treat the isolate the fell sections and treat it, while we are looking for money for the major uh, work, then it will, it will happen, you know, and I'm sure that in the next uh, uh, two weeks, they will have, uh, you know, little money, you know, from us to at least do these palliatives and then begin to, um, you know, start milling, uh, um, you know, why we look for money. Somebody, and like you've suspended him before, you're appointing another one. Now, what we observe, in the mix of all amount of money we are appropriating for this room, year in, year out, it seems our people are like robbing Peter to pay Paul. Now, because if you don't have sanctions, it won't definitely yeah. work at all. You see, this people is like they understand the Nigerian system, whereby everybody wants to rush to be highway uh, uh, supervisor, and because they are on a, a highway supervisor, riding from the company, they see how they just play tricks 
on the road, rub this thing, and we won't get any achievements at all. I think what you have just done here is a demonstration to send money to order your supervisors monitoring your job in other areas at all. By the time we come in, I think we handle it better than this way we are going about. Because we can't, we can't continue in this manner. So this one will not tell me that this thing is not the river sand you actually budgeted for. And it just here sounding as if the, that is the best they are doing to save money. We are paying for sh river sharp sand. River sharp sand. Okay? That's what you are paying. And the, 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 the director, if I was not here two weeks ago, and I gave directives in writing, you know, and this man was also there, it would have been a different ball game altogether. Okay? We are going to bring consultant to the site, and we're going to sit down with them, you know, and then we agree whether they will do the job. If I don't get positive, then I'll drag them to the president and get the job terminated. Sir, if I see you on site again, I will get you arrested. We are not conquered people. Okay? I don't care the blackmail. You know? I don't care the blackmail. You know? But I will continue to fight for the right thing to be done. God and the president gave me the, the powers to do that.